Okay, here's another part of my uh, CNC mill build coming along slowly. Um, this is what I'm going to be using for the z-axis of the mill. Um, this is a, a little um, sliding table that was uh, came off of some retired equipment at work. I've had it for a while and uh, finally decided I can use it for the z-axis on my mill. This is going to mount up here on the superstructure that holds the y-axis. And it's going to mount on this piece of wood here that goes back and forth. That's the y-axis. And then um, this will go up and down to give me uh, up and down motion. The router is going to mount on here. And uh, what am I using as a router? I've got a uh, I've got a rotor zip that will mount on the table. I'm going to make a set of rings for it so I can mount it on the table. And this this will be my z-axis moving the bit up and down against the material or away from it. So that's the plan anyway. Still got a lot of work to do. I haven't even started on the rings yet. So anyway, this uh, this little platform works great driving it with my cordless drill here. Now it's, you can see that, it's got a little uh, scale on it. it. Looks like it was designed for three inches of travel. I took the end plate off of it. I think I can at least get uh, four inches out of it. Maybe even more if it's lightly loaded. But uh, you know, three, four inches of travel, that's, that's going to be plenty for my uh, application. That would be plenty. Now I could be real rednecky and just uh, continue driving it with the drill. Although I'm not sure how how the computer is going to control the drill with any accuracy. My plan is to put a, a cog wheel down here on this and then drive it with a stepper motor with a tooth belt so that um, I can get uh, really good accuracy on my depth. So we'll see how that all works out. I've got all the parts I need. I've got a stepper motor. I've got uh, the, the cog wheels and the tooth belt. It just all the structure needs to be built and mounted up here on the y-axis. So a lot of work to do yet. Um, sometime before I die of old age I may have this thing all together and working. We'll see. Anyway, more later. Keep watching for updates. Thanks.